Greetings, happy humans. What? You're not happy? Well, turn that frown upside down because today we're working with a Melissa and Doug Color by Numbers. I found this book and I totally flipped out because Color by Numbers is my favorite thing ever. And it's all Color by Numbers. There are 12 different pictures in here and they are all so cute. I'm going to color one of those today. But first, I was lucky enough to find another Ami Gammy at the dollar store. And I'm going to build her up so she can watch over our drawing. Woo! This one is a little butterfly. I'm so excited. Oh, I need scissors. Here. Snip. Ah! Ugh, there we go. That should do it. Open it up. If you saw my other videos, you saw that I made um, an Amagami mouse and an Amagami frog already. This is our Amagami butterfly. Down here. <laughs> Come on, butterfly. Come on. Ah! She was really, oh, she was stuck in there. Okay. I got her out. And this butterfly is super cool because she can be turned into a ring and you can wear her around on your finger. There's a little ring piece. Okay, open up her little accessories kit here. I'm just going to cut this open. Alright. So we have some stickers instructions and all of these pretty little wings that you can mix and match and antennae. It's gonna be so fun. I have a tendency with Ami Gammy to just put everything on because I love how it looks when there's like extra everything. So it's like two sets of wings. I think my mouse had two tails. It's really pretty. I might do that again today. I'll have to think about it. Okay, so here's another set of antennae. Okay, so really we could choose, do we want to do these wings with the antennas attached? And which side do we want showing? Or do we want to do these wings with which side showing? And of course the little antennae. They've got different patterns as well. And here is our little clip to clip everything together. I'm going to go ahead and place her on this ring. Ooh, she's not going to stick on there terribly well. Okay, then we're going to go ahead and put her wings back here. I am going to make sure that our butterfly has two sets of wings because they're just so cool. Let's see. Ah, she's so pretty! Okay, and we could leave her like this with those antennae sticking up. Or we can put on the curled antennas, which are a little bit shorter. Those are cute too. Ah, how do you ever decide? This is why I end up putting everything on. It's like you can't you can't decide. Hmm. Oh, such a difficult choice. Okay, we'll do that. All right, so here is her little clippy to keep everything in place. Clip it on. There she is. She's all ready to be put on a finger and worn. This ring's kind of small. I mean, I have small hands and it's small, so whoop, there she is. You can show her off. Um, and also, you can use these stickers to change the way that she looks. Let's see, should we change her eyes a little bit? Hmm, let's try these ones. <laughs> these are reusable stickers, so you can change her again and again. Reuse them up to three times. Here we go. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Okay, there's her new eye. There's her other eye, just a little bit different. There she goes. Oh, she's so pretty. And then, oh, look at these little watermelons. 
plums and berries. She has got all kinds of fruit stickers you can put on her. Oh, I have to try this. <laughs> I'm gonna hook her up with the raspberry. Raspberry off of there. I'm gonna put a raspberry right here on her little head. Right there, oh, so pretty. And there's a yellow apple. And take that off. Put a little yellow apple on her side. Get in there. She's got little feeties. Oh, that doesn't show up very good. It's like yellow on yellow. Let's try again. Let's see. She hasn't got a whole lot of space on her side, so I'm going to take this watermelon and put it right here on the side of her head right there. Cute! Okay, I love her. Absolutely love her. I'm gonna set her off over here so she can watch us. Ooh, what should we name the butterfly? Hmm. Let's name her Pixie. Pixie the butterfly. I'll move her back there. Okay, so I'm so excited about this Colored by Numbers book. It comes with its own markers with a built-in storage. And it says the numbers disappear as you color. Oh, so exciting. The markers out. My little girl tried to open this last night, so it's like, ah. okay. Pop those markers out of there. Oh, they're taped in. Woo! Pop those out. Awesome. Those little storage container intact. Oh, and I bet we could even color on the front of this. How cool. Let's see. <laughs> Each of the, num the markers is numbered so that you know which one to use in your book. But the numbers are also the same color as the marker that you use. So that's pretty easy. Just color this right here, woo! Okay, well the numbers didn't disappear as I colored on the outside of the book, but it's really glossy. So let's see what happens when we look on the inside. So we've got this cool ballerina. We've got a teddy bear, a puppy, a girl and a dolphin. Oh, a fairy! Oh my gosh, with a butterfly! And a little girl out in the rain! Some ice cream and cupcakes! A princess and her castle! Oh wow! And another pretty girl that looks like Rapunzel! She's got so much hair! Okay, and that's it! I think, in honor of our little Amy Gammy butterfly, that I am going to color this page today with the fairy and the butterfly. So let's see. The numbers are so, so light. I'm gonna have to be really careful here. Okay, there's a number six, that's purple. Oh, and they are disappearing as I color. Let's see if you can see that. <laughs> So the numbers are super light to begin with, and they do disappear when you color. All right, Miss Pixie. Keep an eye on me. Make sure I do this right, little butterfly. Okay. So we've got some more sixes in here. My psychotic cat trying to come up and help. Pink is number one. That will impress the pink fans. <laughs> My little girls love, love, love pink, and I love pink. Purple's my favorite, but I love pink. There we go. Little tiny blue space in here. Beep. There. No, get in. No. Why do you always bother me when I'm trying to do this, huh, Fluffican? I'm watching you. Don't you eat my butterfly. Don't you do it. Crazy, crazy psycho kitty. <laughs> the cat is purring. The cat thinks she's hilarious. Ah! I knew you had that look in your eye. I'm watching you, Fluffkin. Stop it. <laughs> Oh, she messed me up! Oh, Fluffy! You made me go outside the lines! You little Fluffkin! You furry little booger! I love this color of blue. This is so pretty! 
<laughs> it means new, new. Move your little paw. Now. <laughs> ah! Fluffy, you're messing me up. These little buttercups. <laughs> you lazy fluffy kitty. You're so funny. <laughs> you're so funny. Oh my goodness, her hair is also yellow. There's a lot of yellow in this picture. How you doing back there, Pixie? Did the cat eat ya? Are you alive? <laughs> Come here, here we go. Gorgeous. I love the colors. So pretty. Oh, her dress is also green. Like Tinkerbell. Pretty skin color. Dainty little fairy legs. Her lips aren't numbered, but I'm going to put this soft pink on them. Oh, prettiness. This beautiful bright yellow in her wings. Just like the sunshine. Alright, will you take a look at that? That is one beautiful color by number picture. And just like they said, the numbers disappeared while I was coloring it. My kitty likes it so much that she's curling up and taking a nap on top of it. Hi, Fluffy. And I think Pixie likes it too. <laughs> oh, silly cat. Just, yeah, just make yourself comfortable there, Fluffkin. Just make yourself comfortable. Well, I've got 11 more pages in here. They're all super cute and fun. Let me know in the comments section if you'd like to see me color another one. Thanks for watching, happy humans. Bye! Bye.